Yo, what's up, Gear Nerds? It's your buddy Dustin from Blue Collar Gear Review. It's been a little while since I've seen you, but I uh, got something super special today. Uh, first time ever doing an unboxing of a pedal that we have in the studios this afternoon. Uh, if you have heard of uh, Arc Enemy or Nevermore, you might recognize Mr. Jeff Loomis and uh, his extraordinary guitar playing ability. I have in my hands today, made by all pedals, the Devil's Triad. We're going to unbox this thing and take a look at it. This is a two-part video, so we're going to unbox it, show you what's inside, uh, kind of just look at the pedal, what's, you know, all the, all the nice bells and whistles off the, um, off the rip. The box is really nice, kind of a cool satin finish. I know it's just a box, but for some of us who are nerdy like that, uh, that's kind of a cool thing. So um, without further ado, let's see what's inside. All right, gear nerds, here we go. Let's dive in. Uh, right off the rip, cool thing. The tab on the box has a magnetic kind of closure there, so it kind of keeps itself shut. Let's see what comes inside this bad boy. All right. Cool little uh, kind of box swag. Is that the actual manual? Cool. That's a pretty nice manual. Kind of talks about some of the features of the pedal itself. Um, kind of as we expected, some sample settings like most pedal companies send with their gear cabling setup talks about the two cable two cable method and the four cable method i'll kind of explain some of that in a minute if you've researched these pedals at all you know this pedal does work well with a four cable setup so let's uh keep going here all right manual and lots of cool colorful artwork there oh that's nice so one of the first things I notice offhand is a ton of foam for packing shipping purposes. Um, so if you were to order this, I don't think you'd have a lot of trouble getting it here safely. So that's kind of cool. All right. There's the pedal itself. And off the, off the rip, the first thing I notice is the, um, the skull and the uh, LED being placed where an eye socket would be. So that's kind of rad. Um, features three um kind of stomp boxes in one large stomp box you have an overdrive or a drive setting you have a solo boost and you have a reverb off and on setting or switch here and apparently you can dial in uh as much reverb and or delay as you want um kind of maybe blending the two so that's pretty cool on the top of the pedal uh this is the four cable thing i was just kind of talking about in the in the manual was kind of, I've done some research on this before and buddy of mine was telling me about the pedal so this is kind of a cool um, way to do things so your boost and your overdrive um, on this section over here is your guitar in and guitar out to your front of your amp then the uh, reverbs and delays can be placed in the effects loop of an amp that has an effects loop um, it does also uh, have a nine volt power supply one kind of setback maybe um, three hundred plus dollar pedal and you don't get a power supply with it but that's kind of, you know, if you're uh, into this kind of stuff, you might already have a board or you might have a uh, power brick or even just a 9-volt adapter somewhere. So that's kind of, not, that's not really a big deal. All right. Well, that's what's inside, guys. The Jeff Loomis Devil's Triad comes with some paperwork, some settings for how to run this bad boy, and a really nice box to, to get it to your, to your studio or to your rig safely. All right. Very cool, guys. Um, this is just an unboxing video. Um, Nothing special yet. This is part one. Uh, just some observations, a look at the pedal itself. This thing has some insane artwork on it. Um, I didn't, uh, I didn't really say it in the beginning of the video, but I went and I did it in the unboxing moment there. But I do want to just kind of point out a couple things. It has a overdrive, a boost, and a effects off and on button on three and one on one pedal. That's kind of cool. If you're looking to um, maybe, um, I don't know, free up some space on your board. I'm looking at mine back here and this, this could easily replace three pedals. It is the size of about two, uh, normal size stone boxes. So you could free up some real estate on your board and, um, I'm ready to hook this bad boy up and, uh, give it a test drive. So if you're interested again, unboxing, um, nice packaging, some, some tutorial information, part two of this video will be some sound samples using the boost, um, the, over the, the overdrive setting, and the uh, the delay and reverb feature, uh, I will be hooking it up in the four cable setup. I do have a fifty one fifty or sixty five hundred five plus back behind me here that features a you know a loop and all that kind of fun stuff. So if you're interested in some sounds, check out part two of this video. And as always, thanks for watching.